Well, as we first reported yesterday, Tulsa Public Schools ran out of snow days. We've learned the district is going to hold classes on President's Day should school be canceled again. But many parents wondered why it wasn't called off today. Two News reporter Brandon Richard is live with that story for us. Brandon? Well, right now, aside from just a little bit of falling drizzle, conditions outside remain clear. It's safe to travel on all of the roadways. But some parents still thought classes should have been canceled today. As Nikki Valenzuela dropped her son off at school this morning, many questions lingered in her head. I was actually pretty surprised. She's hardly alone. Parents upset about Tulsa Public Schools' decision to hold classes Tuesday took to social media to sound off. I'm not sure I understand this decision, one parent wrote on our Facebook page. Another said, bad idea all the way around. One parent would further calling the decision dumb. Well, we've had quite a few calls today. There have been a lot of Facebook uh, messages out there. Chris Payne, TBS spokesperson, says, as always, the decision whether or not to cancel classes rests with the superintendent, who acts on advice from crews sent out to check road conditions. They've got some areas that are kind of trouble spots that they uh, look at and uh, that traditionally are difficult to get in and out of. By mid-morning, snow and sleet moved out of the metro before even getting a chance to stick to roads. Really, the roads aren't all that bad. And by the time school let out, conditions improved even more as temperatures hovered above freezing, bringing peace of mind to many concerned parents. Peace of mind. And aside from Tulsa, most major school districts in the metro area did hold classes today, including Broken Arrow. Reporting live in Midtown, Brandon Richard, 2 News Works for you.